Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. This video is all about fixing the application was unable to start correctly with error code 0xc 4 times 0142 while playing game or opening any application such as GTA, Google Chrome, League of Legends or any other game. So without wasting time, let's go ahead and proceed with the resolution. First of all, click on the start menu and type run. Open an application and type here appwiz.cpl and then hit the enter key. Here click on the option view install updates. And if the error occurred just after you updated your system, simply click on the update option and choose the option uninstall to install the latest update. You can sort this particular update using this date filter by choosing the option installed on. Nextly you can do is to right click on the program which is not opening such as Google Chrome. If it is not opening, right click and choose the option properties over here. Choose the option compatibility tab and here click on the option run this program in compatibility mode. Once done, hit apply and ok button. Now go ahead and check if the error code the application was unable to start correctly is still exist or not. If the error still persists, in second step, right click on start menu and choose the option device manager over here. Expand your display adapter and note down the name of your display adapter. At my end, it is Intel HD Graphics 5500. So make sure you note down the name of your graphic driver. Then open your web browser and here I will show you all three websites for NVIDIA, for AMD and for Intel, how you can download. Here is the official NVIDIA website, choose the product type and then choose the series, product and windows, then click on the search option to find a driver for your system. Click on download option and click on this download link to download the NVIDIA drivers onto your system. Save it wherever you want. Same way for AMD also, scroll down to this website and here simply choose your product. Even you can type over here to find the graphic driver of your AMD and once chosen, simply click on the submit button. Here also expand the type of windows you have and then click on the download button to download the AMD drivers. As it is for Intel, here is the website, scroll down, click on the graphic option over here. From this left pane, which is showing filter by, scroll down and choose your Intel family graphics. Mine is Intel HD, so I'll click over here. Again, let's filter more by scrolling the options over here. My family is Intel HD graphics 5500. I'll click on it and here's the download link. Click on this download button to download the driver as per your graphic card. Once the program is downloaded, go ahead and install it in your system just like you install any other program or any software in your system. Once done, don't forget to restart your system and check if the error code 0xc0000142 in your GTA or any other game still exists or not. If it is still there, let's proceed with the third fix. Click on start menu, type run. In run application type, reg edit and hit the enter key. Now here in address bar, you need to paste a path. I will share this path in the description of this video. Once pasted, hit the enter key. Now in this right pane, you will find the option of load app. Double click to open it. And in value data, if it is 1, make sure you give it a value 0. Once it is 0, hit OK. Close reg edit and then again try to play the game your GTA or League of Legends and check if the error code 0xc0000142 is still exist or not. If it is still there, let's proceed with the fourth step. Click on start menu, type CMD. Run CMD as an administrator. Now in this process, we are going to re-register your DLL files. For that, I have a script, copy the script and paste in CMD by pressing the Ctrl V button and then hit the enter key. Now again, copy the second script 
and press by pressing control V button and then hit the enter key. Once it is done, close it and then don't forget to restart your PC and check if the error code is still exists or not. Now if all the ways fails, the last option we have is to install Microsoft Visual C++ and .NET Framework. Here is the website, official website for Microsoft Visual C++. Click on this download option and here if you have a 64 bit, choose the first file. If you have a 32 bit system, choose the second file. I have 64 bit, I will choose the first file and then click on the next button to find the download link of Microsoft Visual C++. Scroll down, save it in your desktop or wherever you want. As it is, here is the official website for .NET Framework. Download .NET Framework 4.8 version. Click on this download link. Save this .NET also in your system. Once the both files save, install both the files one by one. After that, don't forget to restart your system and try to play your GTA or League of Legends again. This way, you will not be encountered again the error code 0xc000142. The application was unable to start correctly. However, if all the ways fails, you need to open your settings menu. Scroll down. Click on the option recovery tab. Now here you will find the option of reset this PC. Click on it. And here choose the first option which is keep my files so that it will not delete any file of yours. But this process will uninstall any program you have installed in your system. Choose the option local reinstall. And once it is done, press the next key and this will reset your PC to the factory restore settings. This way it will not delete any kind of data of yours but it will uninstall the programs that you have installed in your system in the control panel. Once it is done your PC will restart automatically and this will fix out the error. The application was unable to start correctly 0xc000142. So these are the best possible ways to fix out your issue while playing games like Valorant or opening any other application such as Microsoft Office or Google Chrome. If you are new to this channel and this program fix out for you, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and click on the bell icon to continue receiving more such updates from my channel. Keep watching Lotus Geek. Thank you so much friends.